you are looking live at a recorded simulation of the Sun Bowl in El Paso, Texas. The Conference USA play begins with Oklahoma Tech taking on UTEP today on NCAA football. Welcome to the Sun Bowl, Outlaw Nation. Let's get Conference USA play started. The Miners win the toss, defer to the second half. Fisher and Vela back deep. Vela will take it just inside the goal line. He's going to bring it out. Swerves right back left to the middle, and he's stacked up there. 20-yard return, first and 10 at the 19. Romero give to Anderson. Off the left side, he's got a lane. That's going to be a gain of nine, second and one. Romero rolls right. Throws a dart to Palmer. He's got it. That's a 15-yard reception and a first down. First and 10. Romero get to the Yeti. He's hit hard right at the line of scrimmage. No gain. Second and 10. Romero drops back. Finds Doolin on a short route underneath. Gain of five. It's going to bring up a third and five. Romero drops back. He's kept dropping and tried to get rid of it, but... Nothing there. That's going to bring up fourth and five. Wellington on for the punt. Gets into it. Gets a nice bounce there. Carter's going to pick it up. Oh, that's a nice break for the Outlaws. He stepped out there. Miners take over. First and ten. Quick pass out to the left. McDonald and Pittman are there. That's a loss of two. Second and twelve. Give debates off the left side. Jorge tracks him down. That's just a gain of two. Third and ten. McCoy back to pass. Let's one fly over the middle. Nobody's there. We're gonna bring up fourth and ten. The miners on the punt. Baylor gonna field it about the 44, and he's hit right there. Maybe one. Oh, he got dragged down by the face mask there. So that's gonna be an extra 15 tacked on for the outlaws. So we're gonna start off in good field position here. First and ten, 3:33 to go in the first. Romero drops back. Fires one off the right side, but he overthrows Yeti. He had him wide open. Missed opportunity there. Give the Yeti up the middle. He's got running room. He's going to pick up six. That's going to bring up a third and four. Romero drops back. That's one fly. Perk had a step and had a little room, but Romero just threw it out the back of the end zone. Fourth and four. They're going for it. He fires Perkins again. That's good. Perkins runs over two guys, but can't. Cannot keep his balance. 22-yard gain. First and 10 outlaws. Romero rolls right. Trying to find somebody to throw to. He's going to tuck it and run. And he's pinballing off of Miners until he's knocked out of bounds. That's a nine-yard gain. Second and one. Give to Anderson off the left side. He's in. Touchdown. Hold on. Hold on. They're going to look at it. Can't tell from that shot. Can't see nothing from that shot. There's a whole mess of linemen there. Here we go. If he's down, late reach. They're gonna they're gonna mark it short. After review of the play, the ruling on the field. So take the six off the board. And it's gonna leave it at first and goal. Had enough to pick up the first down. First and go. Give to Romero. He's stacked up again. He's not going to pick it up. No game. Outlaws in the high formation. Give to Anderson. He's got the corner. And that's a touchdown. Outlaws. 60 row, 55 seconds to go in the first. RJ Anderson just outran the miners there. Headed towards the pylon. And that's six. Wellington on for the PAT. It's good. The Outlaws lead 7 to 0. Wellington's kickoff. Well, fielded in the end in minors by Bates, and he takes a knee right there. First and 10, UTEP. 54 seconds to go in the four. first. McCoy drops back, and the pass is just dropped by his tight end. Second and 10. McCoy drops back, rolls right. Ryan Stokes tracks him down, sacks him. That's a loss of four. Third and 14. McCoy fires one over the middle to Smith. He breaks the tackle and picks up the first down. That's a gain of 17. First and 10 minors. 
18 seconds to go in first. Give the Bates around the right side. Jorge tracks him down after a gain of four, second and six. Boy, flips out a quick pass, but nobody's there. And that's going to be the end of one. And the Outlaws over, over the Miners, seven to zero. Let's keep it up, fellas. Second quarter begins with a third and six for the Miners. McCoy's going to drop back to pass and just throws it away. Nobody home. So here comes the punt. Ayla is going to field it about the 16-yard line. Cuts right back to the left. He's got a little bit of room, but it closes up quickly. That's a 15-yard return. First and 10 outlaws. Davis in at quarterback. A little tri triple option look. He's going to keep it for a gain of two. Romero back in. Drops back to pass. Fires over the middle. And it's going to be incomplete. Lucky it wasn't intercepted. Third and eight. He's got Doolin for a short game. Johnny D picks up four, but that's going to be fourth and four. So Wellington's on to punt again. Good bounce on this one. Wilson overruns Carter. Two men overrun it. Wheat finally tracks him down, has a collision, and he's pushed out of bounds. First and ten minors. The screen pass out to Bates. He's picking up blocks. Johnson tracks him down. He can't hang on. Bates is down the sidelines. Nobody's going to catch him. That's going to be a touchdown for the Miners. 70-yard TD reception for Jared Bates. Joey Johnson had him there, but couldn't bring him down. He breaks the tackle. We got tackle bet better, fellas. We're throwing these chicken wings on people. 7-7, 527 to go in the second. Fisher's going to take it about two yards deep, bring it right up the middle. Starts to fade right and back to the middle. It's a 22-yard return. Outlaw started at 20. Give the Yeti. He takes it off the left side and grinds for three. Second and seven. Marrow. Give to Anderson. He tries to get out wide on the left side. Only pick up, picks up two. He's going to bring up a third and five. Marrow rolls right. Trying to find somebody. Dumps it off to Doolin. He makes a nice grab. That's going to be a gain of 12. That's going to be first and seven outlaws. Give to Wheat. He rumbles forward. He's going to pick up three. He's going to bring up second and seven. 3.34 to go in the second. Give to Anderson off the left side. He's got room. He's going to pick up eight. And that's another outlaw's first down. First and 10. Camaro on the keeper. And he is shut down in the backfield. That's a loss of three. He's going to bring up a second and 13. Romero drops back. Throws one up, and the Yeti goes and gets it. Nice adjustment. 17 yards and a first down out lost. Give to Anderson off the left side. He's going to pick up four. He's going to bring up second and six. 138 to go in the half. Second and six. Give to Anderson. He bounces it outside. Nice run by Anderson. He picks up 10 before he's shoved out of bounds. First and 10. 131 to go. Romero drops back left. Throws one up for Doolin, and he can't come down with it. It was a contested catch. It's going to bring up second and 10. Romero drops back. Fires one to Johnson. He's wide open, and he drops it. Preston Johnson drops a touchdown. Romero, third and 10, finds Gabriel. He's tracked down after a gain of seven. It's going to bring up fourth and three. With 38 seconds to go in the half, the Outlaws call a timeout. They're going to bring on Wellington, try and take a three-point lead here. Wellington's kick is up, and it's good. From 34 yards out, the Outlaws lead 10-7 with 35 seconds to go in the half. Kickoff from Wellington. Bates is going to take it at the end. The end in minors, and he takes a knee. First and 10, UTEP. McCoy drops back. He's going to scramble up the middle. Flanagan dives and gets his ankles. That's a gain of four. Second and six. McCoy drops back. Throws it deep, and he's got a man. Wells, 20, 15, 10, and Vela tracks, tracks him down after a 61-yard gain. 23 seconds to go. Give to Bates off the right. Johnson's got him, and he can't hang on again. And Bates is going to score. Nine-yard touchdown, and the Miners... In just three plays in what 17 seconds score and they lead 14 10. 18 seconds to go in the half fisher's going to take it right up the left side tries to bounce it outside he's got some room 30 35 40 
45, and he's pushed out after a 47-yard return. Nice run by Fisher. Romero fires one up over the middle to Palmer, and he can't come down with it. Nice effort there. Second and 10, five seconds to go. Romero throws one up, trying to find Palmer again. It's going to be picked off by Houston, and Yeti hits him in the mouth right there, and that's the end of the first half. And the Miners lead 14 to 10. Some missed opportunities there in that half. The Outlaws look to regroup and come out in the second half and make some changes. Drop touchdown pass by Johnson really hurt. Anderson's touchdown run to get us on the board. Wellington with a field goal. But missed tackles, big plays, and missed opportunities leave the Outlaws behind by four at the half. Here we go again with our time of possession, 11.30 to 2.30. The offense just doesn't feel like it can get in a rhythm today. Let's see if we can change it in the second half. Wellington, kick off to start the second half. Toe meets Leather, and Bates is going to take it two yards deep. He's going to bring it out right up the middle. Fades right, left. Nice return, 29 yards. First to 10 minors. Play fake. McCoy fires up to Sanders. He makes the grab. Nice catch. He's going to be brought down at the 50. First and ten minors. Get to Bates, left side. He's met in the backfield and stopped right there. Nice job. Loss of three, second and 13. McCoy drops back to pass. He's going to fire one out to Sanders again, this time off the right side. He runs into Balser and slung down right there. Third and two. Pitch out to Bates, and he's got a lot of room off the left side. One man misses him, and then he throws an elbow into a jaw. Is that Pittman? It don't matter. One of the zebras threw a hanky and it's coming back. It's going to be third and 12 after a clipping penalty. 5.55 to go in third. McCoy drops back to pass. And he's going to throw it away. Nobody's open. So we get the fourth and 12 and the Miners will punt it back to the outlaws. Vela deep to receive. He's at the 10 yard line. He's going to take it right there. Try to take it out to the right, but he can't get the corner. He's going to be tackled at the 15, just a four yard return. First and 10 outlaws. Give to Anderson off the left side. He's got a little bit of room. That's a five yard gain. He's going to be up second and five. Give to the Yeti off the left side. He's got a lot of room. Nice run by the Yeti. Gain of 11. That's going to give us first and 10 outlaws. Romero on the keeper. He's going to take it up the middle. That's going to be a gain of five. He's going to bring up second and five. Romero drops back. He's got Anderson wide open over the middle. He tries to spin away from the defender. He can't do it. He's tackled after a gain of 14, but that's another outlaw's first down. First and 10 at midfield. Give to Yeti. He tries to cut back and find a lane, but no doing. That's going to be a loss of one. Second and 11. Romero drops back to pass. He's got Doolin. Doolin's going to take it for a gain of 14. That's going to be a first and 10 outlaws. Romero, give to Anderson up the middle. He's got a lot of room. He pick, picks up a block from Perkins, and he's stacked up there by a couple of minors, but that's a gain of 16 in an outlaws. First down. Romero rolls right. Can't find anybody. Tries to get it back to Palmer, but it's going to fall short and incomplete. Second and 10. Davis into the game. Triple option look. Give to Yeti. That's just going to be a gain of one. It's going to bring up third and nine. Romero. Back in the game, rolls right. Tries to fit one into Doolin, but he can't hang on as he's sandwiched by two defenders. So Wellington comes on for the field goal, and he knocks through beef. Wellington for three, the Outlaws are within one. 14-13, 148 to go in the third. Wellington's kickoff, Bates is gonna take it in the end zone about three yards deep, and he'll take a knee. The Miners start first and 10 for 20, with 148 to go in the third. McCoy drops back to pass. It's a screen pass to Bates, and he's picking up blocks, and he has a lot of room. Made a move on a couple of guys, and then big Huey Brown tracks him down. But that's first and 10 minors near Finfield. Get the Bates up the middle. He shakes a man, and then Balser hammers him, but that's an 11-yard gain. First and 10 minors. Smith on the grab. That's a four-yard perception. That's going to bring up a second and six. McCoy drops back. Fires one out to McCollum, and he's wide open. Can Pittman track him down? Not in time. He falls into the end zone. That's a 42-yard touchdown catch. 
The Miners are up 20 to 13. BAT is up and good. The Miners stretch their lead to eight. Update from Maryville, Northwest, Bearcats. Take out the Bears, 42-26. 110 to go in the third. Vela fields the kickoff about a yard deep, and he comes out with it. He's swerving left and right, and he's drilled at the 20. First and 10 outlaws. Romero give to Anderson up the middle. Tries to cut back right, and stumbles forward for a gain of five. Second and five, Romero fires to Perkins. Nice grab. That's going to be a pickup of seven and a first down outlaw. 17 seconds to go in the third. Romero drops back the pass. He finds a Yeti who shucks off the defender. Plows forward for four more yards. It's 14-yard gain. First and 10 outlaws. Romero, as time expires in the third, fires one after Perkins. He's got it. That's going to be a gain of nine. And at the end of three, the outlaws trail by eight. But they're moving down the field. Let's see if we can tie this thing up. Second and one, Romero drops back the pass and is batted down. Third and one, Romero rolls right. He's got Doolin who spins on a man, makes a miss. He's to the 30. He's dropped right there, but nice catch and run by John Doolin. First and 10 outlaws give to Anderson. He tries to squeeze through a lane there. He's going to pick up three, second and seven. Romero give to Anderson. He's got a little hole, but it closed quickly. That's a gain of four. Third and four. Romero drops back. He's got Johnson. That's just a three-yard gain. Fourth and one. Offense stays on the field. Romero give to Anderson. Off the left side. He's going to pick up three. And that's an outlaw's first down. After a short gain of three, second and seven. Anderson loses one. That's going to bring up a third and nine. Romero fires down the middle to Perkins. Oh, he couldn't quite get in. He's dropped at the goal line. First and goal, Outlaws. Romero, give to Yeti, and he's in. Touchdown, Outlaws. Yeti gets in to bring us within two. Now, what do we got for a two-point conversion? 319 to go in the ballgame. Outlaws need to tie it up here. Romero's going to roll right. Yeti breaks free, but Romero can't pull the trigger any sack. And the score remains 21 to 19. 319 to go. UTEP's going to take a knee, so they'll start first and 10 with 319 at their own 20. McCoy drops back. He finds Sanders, who tiptoes out of bounds. It's just a gain of two, second and eight. Give the Bates, and he's hit hard by Stokes for a loss of three, third and 11. Miners run the clock down. It's a screen pass to Bates, and he's got a lot of room. And Harold can't make the tackle. Bates is going to pick up 15 yards, and it's a first down. Pass to Sanders. He picks up eight, second and two. Outlaws burn a timeout. 2.16 to go. McCoy's going to tuck it and run, and he's going to pick up the first down. 2.12 to go, first and 10. McCoy drops back. He hits Sanders again, and he's open. Somehow he gets stopped before making the first down. It's second and one, 2.06 to go. McCoy drops back. He's got Bates. He's knocked out of bounds after a loss of one. It's third and two, two minutes to go in the ballgame. Hand off to Bates. And Vela comes in and makes a great tackle. And the Outlaws are out of timeouts. They're going to get it back with about one minute left. We're going to let it bounce into the end zone. So one minute, 14 seconds left. No timeouts. We've got to get in field goal range. Romero drops back to pass. Throws one deep for Palmer, and he can't come down with it. It's going to be second and 10, 109 to go. Romero drops back. It's Doolin off the right side. That's a short gain. It's going to bring up a third and five. On the ball quickly, 44 seconds to go. Romero drops back. Hits Gabriel. That's going to be enough for the first down. Clock stops while they move the chains. First and 10, 41 seconds to go. Romero drops back. He throws one deep for Palmer, and it's picked off by Davis. And with no timeouts remaining, the Miners can just take a knee and end the ballgame. Oh, man. Well, that was a kick in the nether regions. 
21-19, UTEP wins. It's the final. Outlaws just didn't feel like they could get in the rhythm offensively today. And the defense couldn't tackle and gave up big plays. Romero, 17-30 for 185. No touchdowns, two picks. Anderson, 14 carries, 69 yards. Wheat, 8 for 24. Romero, 4 for 14. And Davis, 2 for 4. Johnny D led us in receiving with 6 for 53 today. Perkins, 4 for 54. Gabriel, 2 for 15. Wheat, 2 for 31. Anderson, 1 for 14. Johnson, 1 for 3. And Palmer, 1 for 15. Of course, nobody blocks. Defensively, McDonald led the way. Five tackles, two tackles for, tackles for loss. Stokes had two tackles for loss and a, stat, and a sack. Ugh. Kicking the nethers. We just play good on defense one game, and then we just have a complete meltdown the next game. But Wellington, two for two. One for one on extra points. Two punts for 89 yards, 44-5 average. Baylor, two returns for 40 yards. Fisher, two for 68 on kickoffs. Baylor, three punt returns for 19 yards. Team stats, barely even. It was a close game. It's just disappointing how it ended there. Really thought we could drive down the field and get Wellington in range to kick a game-winning field goal, but it just didn't happen. Two turnovers today. Again, we didn't create any turnovers. We lose by two points. Of course, dominated the time of possession. That's our thing, man. There's your scoring summary. Once again, a kick in the nethers to the Outlaw Nation today. But we'll be back. We got a home game next weekend against New Mexico State. Be sure to like, subscribe, support the channel, comment, hoist trophies, win championships. For the Tater Sports Network, I'm Chip D. Till next time, see ya. You crazy mother...